Science communication across the globe is viewed as an important component of institutional development in the dissemination of scientific findings of most scientists either in agriculture, environment, health and technology. The dissemination of most of this information are mostly done in scientific jargons that makes it difficult for the layman to understand science, since most journalists hardly write reports on the work of scientists due to the lack of understanding of the subject area. At a three-day workshop for scientists in Africa and the media in Nairobi, Kenya, on the theme The Role of Media in Science Communication, a sub-Saharan Africa's youth editor, Ochio Ogodo, called for a paradigm shift in the courses that are taught in the journalism institutions and urged authorities to incorporate science journalism as a specialized course for study to enhance science communication. Journalism is, is a specialty and uh, it's unfortunate that in most of African countries it's not done as a special course uh, either at the colleges or at the universities and therefore people who venture into science journalism may have trained as uh, journalists but not with a background on science uh, journalism. So I, I think there should be a paradigm shift in the way uh, we do things in our journalism schools. We need to incorporate science journalism as a special uh, subject in these schools. That way we'll manufacture lots of people who will be able to communicate science. Ms. Ogodo further advocated for communication to be taught at higher level for easy dissemination of information irrespective of the profession one finds themselves. So that makes me uh, advocate for communication as what should be taught in higher institutions so that whether they are scientists, whether they are people who are doing art, they are able to communicate to the people and that way disseminate their own skills and their findings. As the workshop comes to a close, one of the critical things that has come up is the fact that there is a need for collaboration between scientists and journalists because there is the need for those findings that scientists have really discovered to be made public. From Nairobi, Kenya, Nuanash reporting for Vasat One News.